Hi, my name is Ruth and this is Fay Hollow Homestead. Um, I'm going to give you a quick video today because things have been nuts lately and I've also been very sick, like just a very big sinus infection. And so, and raining all day, every day for like the last four or five days, it's been hard to get out here. So I've got something I did want to show you though. I did this a little while ago. I pruned my butterfly bush because I transplanted it and it went into transplant shock, which was not surprising. That's what they do. And so, um, pruning it back will give it a real good chance of rejuvenating itself, even though it looks really sad. So let me show you how great uh, it looks after, and then let me show you what I did before in order to get that prune. You can see it is looking super sad, and I've decided to uh, cut it back because anytime you transplant something, uh, most of the time you're going to end up uh, cutting off some of the roots. and so. Uh, when I transplanted this, apparently that happened and the roots are not big enough to support this huge uh, bush anymore. And so I'm going to prune it back uh, pretty hard actually, uh, which will give it a chance to just kind of recuperate and, and become alive again. And it will be able to start putting on new growth and really set its roots into where it is right now without worrying about struggling so hard. a very dramatic change but this is gonna be really good for it you can see there's already some new growth coming on it so that's good and um, just watering it every day sometimes when people transplant um, big plants like this and they see them go into shock uh, they end up over watering it and so um, I'm just making sure that I water it every other day really good uh, and I don't want to drown it pruning it is good and uh, given a little bit of fertilizer uh, and that's about all we can do and it's gonna recuperate maybe not as fast as I'd like but it will recuperate and it will become glorious once again came just right out of that that hole <laughs> do you guys see that there's a second one right here so it looks so bad right now but if you see we've got new growth coming out on the branches looking super strong this is not growth that's wilting this is strong growth and it's rejuvenating and it's starting again you can even see down here there's some there's some down farther down on the branches there's one right here uh, there's a lot of really good growth going on and I'm very excited I mean it, it does it looks bad right here it lost most of its leaves but it's coming back and that's what I wanted and I can wait a year for it to look really, really beautiful again. Waiting is no big deal for me. So if you have a bush or a tree or something that you've transplanted that's gone into shock and looks bad, a great idea might be pruning it. Uh, look it up though. Sometimes there are individual needs for individual plants, but as a general rule, pruning things back is gonna really help rejuvenate them. This is really only a week, maybe a week and a half after I pruned it back that we're already seeing this new vigorous growth. So great stuff right there. Thank you so much for sticking with me. You guys have a wonderful day. Please hit the like button, the notification bell, and the subscription button. That would help me out a whole lot and stay blessed.